Hi everyone, I'm Bethany and I'm a doctoral student here at Vanderbilt University within the en Environmental Engineering Department and I'm also from Nashville, Tennessee and I love it here and also I'm a fellow within the Vanderbilt Institute for Energy and the Environment. So my research really boils down to one question. What are the life cycle environmental impacts from electricity production through all the phases of mining and extraction of different energy sources to handling waste? So this includes the coal and nuclear and natural gas fuel cycles. And really, we're also concerned with human health impacts as well and we're assessing the radiological and chemical risk from different and various advanced nuclear fuel cycles. And so that, this is important because this represents the future of nuclear energy within the United States. One very exciting aspect of my research here at Vanderbilt is that I get to help utilities plan which power plants they add onto the grid. And so it's a really important decision on which power plant makes the least amount of uh, emissions and environmental impact to uh, our community and also how it affects our generations to come in the future. I really enjoy the great community that Vanderbilt has here in the graduate department, especially in the environmental engineering department, because we share the same values and of preserving and protecting the environment. So you're really working towards a common goal. Graduate work here at Vanderbilt really prepares anyone for a successful career because of the cutting edge research that all of the faculty bring in. There are numerous members of the faculty here at Vanderbilt that are on presidentially appointed boards such as the Nuclear Waste Technical Review Board and also members of the National Academies. And Vanderbilt also prepares you for a successful career because of the way that these faculty include you on these projects and how you're really incorporated and a member of the team when you're on these uh, research projects. 